Hi, my name is Suba Gerwell and I'm a math expert. And today we're going to go over how to convert from cubic feet to kilowatt hours. So it's kind of simple. The first thing you're going to want to do is convert from cubic feet to cubic meters. You can do that by multiplying by a value of 2.83 approximately. That will take us from cubic feet to meters. The second thing that you're going to want to do is multiply by a correction factor. You're like, oh, correction factor, what does that mean? Well, basically when they're figuring out how much energy is in a cubic foot of gas, they're doing it with the assumptions of a standard temperature and a standard height. So depending on where you are in the world, you might need to correct for what temperature and height you're at when you're using your gas, because that's going to affect the amount of energy you're going to get out of the gas that you're using. So like for in Britain, for example, it's like 1.022, something like that, something really small. And the third thing we're going to multiply by is the calorific value. Now this is the measure of the heat in the gas that's in the cubic foot. You can find this value oftentimes on the last gas bill that you got sent to your residence. They'll often give you this measure, this calorific value. So you just take all these, multiply it by 2.83, the correction factor, calorific value. That'll take you from cubic feet to kilowatt hours. My name is Subo Gerwal, and thank you for taking an interest in math.